Hello and thanks for joining School of the American Rifle. Today's video is going to be a quick one, just a quick tech tip. I'm uh, doing some ramp polishing on extractors, polish the ramp up, the uh, rim of the cartridge seats into the extractor with less effort, but got a order of extractors in and checking them out, gauging the groove, polishing the ramp, and checking the extractor spring pocket. It's a pretty common problem. Just about all manufacturers that put, let's just say, um, less than good springs will often have this pocket here. It's undersized and I have this gauge here and this gauge is supposed to go into the pocket. I'm doing this video one handed and basically click in and that says that that pocket's sufficient to take a good spring. A good spring has a larger diameter wire which is either a four coil Colt, a four coil spring co or a five coil spring co. Um, here's one that I've opened up. Let me try to grab it. And there we go. That's how it'll hook in when it's good. This one, no matter what I do, it will not hook in. And my hands are dirty, if that bothers you. Too bad. I'm working. But it will not grab into this extractor. So basically, you've got to open the pocket up to take a good spring. So what does that mean if I try to put a good spring in there? Well, it means that you have to use a lot of force, and sometimes you can damage a good spring and reduce the life of it. So your good spring might not last as long as you would hope it would if you try to basically crush it in there. Um, and here is a, uh, a Colt extractor. No modifications done to the pocket. And there she goes. So, as always, regardless of who you buy stuff from, inspect it, gauge it. As always, I hope you found this video educational, and thanks for watching.